How to enter and track purchases in Smart Contractor. When you receive bills from your vendors and subcontractors, you'll need to pay them. If you're like many contractors, you're probably entering your bills and printing checks in QuickBooks, and you probably know how much time that takes and how easy it is to make mistakes or to lose track of how much was paid and for what materials. Smart Contractor makes this a lot easier, quicker, and more accurate because the data for what you purchase or subcontract is already in the job estimate. So all you need to do to track your purchases is to select the item purchased from the list, verify the item count and unit cost, and click OK. Smart Contractor automatically writes purchase entries to transactions in QuickBooks. So then all you have to do is go to QuickBooks and pay bills and print checks. To enter purchases in Smart Contractor, go to Enter Purchases in the Purchase menu. Click Add New to add a new purchase. Select the vendor or subcontractor that the purchase is from. The program will list all items in the job estimate. You can go through the list to find and click on each item in the bill you are entering, but it's much easier to shorten the list of items by using the Purchase Item Selection criteria. You can select purchase items by job project or by job, but an easier way to find purchased items is to select the vendor the bill is from. Or better yet, select the purchase order that you use for the purchase. This will pull up the items in the purchase order and default the purchase counts and costs to the amount in the purchase order. Click the purchase item to select it and verify the purchase count and unit cost. The Purchase Complete box allows you to indicate whether you anticipate purchasing more of the item. If you check Purchase Complete, that item will no longer appear in the list of items to purchase. If you need to enter a purchase for an item that is not in the job estimate, you can do that in the bottom line of the list by entering information about the item purchased. If you're running Smart Contractor connected to QuickBooks, you will notice these additional prompts on the screen. The Prompt for Payment method allows you to indicate whether the purchase was made on account or, if it has already been paid for, whether it was paid with a check, credit card, or cash. Each of these options will cause Smart Contractor to create the appropriate transaction in QuickBooks. To complete the purchase entry, enter the vendor's reference number, such as the invoice number or vendor's order number. Notice the Add Attachment button. This allows you to attach any file or document, such as a scanned invoice, to the purchase transaction. To attach a document, click Add New in the prompt for document, fill in the prompts in the screen, and click OK. You can attach any number of documents to each transaction in Smart Contractor. Attachments to all transactions are accessible in the Attachments tab in the Edit Job screen. Once you have entered purchases in Smart Contractor, you can now automatically generate customer invoices and print a variety of job costs and financial forecast reports. Please see the videos on creating invoices in Smart Contractor reports for more information. This concludes the tutorial video on entering purchases in Smart Contractor. Thank you for watching.